This may just look like a Windows machine with a bit of a weird start menu, but there's actually far, far more. This is Windows MSN Edition 7.0, the most amazing Windows ever made. You've got all of these crazy options over here. You can call Microsoft Support right from here, which just takes you to a deleted-microsoft.com page. Interesting. Um, ah, how do I, how do I, well, there we go. All right, so, uh, we can do Windows Update. We can get help with MSN. We can advertise on MSN right from here. Basically, everything you can do is about the internet, about MSN. Welcome, welcome in user, the artist. Supposedly, you can change that, but I can't find that option. Ooh, there's an About button. Ah, there's the info for the designer and graphic. You've got your favorites over here for your MSN, including your horoscope, which just takes you to MSN.com. Great. you got your eShops, your movies, your radio, your sports, your music, and your chat. Basically, all of you take you to MSN.com. I checked. But you can go through multiple pages of favorites here. You've got your Explore, your Play, your Find, worldwide channels, links, and resources. What else we got? we got air tickets, books, disaster aid, downloads, send money, wireless updates. I don't know what that is exactly. We've got shared photo. We can hear music. It's the best thing to do with music. We've got free games, greeting card, horoscopes, again. We've got stock quotes, yellow pages, fine classmates, weather and direction. we got Weeder. <laughs> Weeder is the best. we got event tickets. No C, but event tickets. we got worldwide, English, Spanish, Canada, Mexico, UK, and India. Those are all the countries. We got our MSN channel, including pets and animals and women. And then if you click next again, it just takes you to MSN. This is not a scroll through. That one just goes to MSN. You got your favorites up here, which is fun. Now here's an interesting thing you'll notice. The start menu here, it does not work at all. Not even a little bit. I'm running Internet Explorer right now. Can I open it? Can I close it? Nope, not there. You gotta manually close it like that. This taskbar doesn't work. This over here, my clock's there, apparently. Oh, this is amazing. Now, these are all now crazy um, drop downs, which is great, and you just wanna open Explorer because you can't. Like, oh no, I'll just go like what double click on my music. No, that just opens it. Got our internet, you know, an explorer buttons, our MSN buttons. We've got an MSN button. On our MSN theme. Basically every pixel on this image is an MSN button. That's an MS that's not actually an MSN button. The fun part is this is actually edition seven point zero I actually got a date and time button here, which is handy because I'm often wanting to change the date on my computer and I don't want to double click on my invisible clock over here. You can adjust our invisible volume right from here, supposedly. Execute. Uh, it's just run menu, it's not super awesome. So, yeah, this is Windows MSN version. Ah! It disappears if you go. I don't know how what made it disappear. I moved the cursor too hard, I guess, and it's scared. It's scared. It's scared. <laughs>